So what is good everyone and welcome back to another video on today's Wave Wednesday. Wave Wednesdays, it's lit every Wednesday. It's lit every Wednesday. It's lit every Wednesday. It's lit every Alrighty guys, for today's Wave Wednesday, if you remember from the last video, I told you guys that today's video would probably be a tattoo video. And yeah, that, that's exactly what it is. I'm currently filming this Monday the 9th. My tattoo appointment is at 5.30 today. And it's currently 4.21. So, uh, you know, we got about an hour. I slept good last night. Took a little bit of a nap before. But uh, now I just got to get that last meal in. You know, make sure I get my nutrients and everything. I drank a lot of water. Staying hydrated uh, so I don't faint on the chair. But uh, yeah, I'm not so nervous with this one as I was with my first one. For obvious reasons. I've been through one before. The only thing I'm worried about is... Uh, obviously, I'm ready for this one probably to be a little bit more painful. Because I'm getting it on my forearm. My thigh has like more meat on it, right? So the parts of your body with more muscle and stuff are gonna obviously be less painful and the parts with more bone and like skinny and stuff like that and parts of your body with like less muscle are obviously gonna hurt a bit more but I uh, it's gonna be like a moderate pain so uh, I'm not that nervous I'm going into it excited and uh, I can't wait to see how it's gonna turn out so I'll kind of take you guys through the process and then I'll show you guys what it looks like when it's done and then I'll give you guys a bit of a review on it so let's go right now Alrighty guys, what is up? It is now the next day. As you guys just saw from those past shots, that was just a bit of what the place looked like. I got some footage of me getting the tattoo, and now I'll show, I'll show you guys the finished product. So yes guys, as you saw, I did get a wave. I got it on my forearm. Originally what I was supposed to do is get the wave on my forearm, and then the two outer sides were gonna kind of wrap around my whole arm, and on the other side, there'd be another wave. So kind of like it's double-sided, one on that side and one on this side. But then uh, the girl, you know, I asked her what, what she thought about it. She said for now, she thinks it's better to just to do the one side on the forearm. In the future, if I want, I can always continue it. So yeah, everything went well. The place was called Base to Face. You know, the girl that was working there was quick. She was fast. She knew what she was doing. I'd say I was there for maybe 45 minutes. She printed out the design, you know, sized it on me and stuff like that. And then drew it out on her piece of paper and put it on my arm and stuff. And literally the process of getting the actual tattoo was not even like 10-15 minutes it was so fast and uh yeah guys if you're wondering about the pain uh like i said for my last tattoo i barely even remember my last tattoo that much it that's how much it didn't really hurt and this one either man like if you're stressing too much about the pain if you know you don't get too like her easy like it's it, it should be fine for you it literally just feels like a little bit of a scratch it's not like something that's like oh my god get me out of here like you're going crazy like it's literally doable it's gonna maybe it'll feel a little bit uncomfortable from the start but for me i sat there fine i was just on my phone chilling there and it was nothing you know for obvious reasons you guys know why i did get a wave you know my whole kind of brand behind everything is the d2 wave you know the wave wednesdays and everything and i just like the way a wave looks and as you guys uh, know a wave is like the strongest natural force you know it, it could resemble uh pushing you to success in the future you know stuff like that so so it has meaning to it and uh you know i just like the way it looks i thought it fit pretty well I made sure to eat a lot before i went i drank a lot of water those are just some tips guys if you ever want to get a tattoo in the future uh, just make sure to eat uh, before you get the tattoo you know have a good breakfast have a good night's sleep before uh, and then right before you get the tattoo like maybe an hour before ish try to get another meal in and uh, they always say you want to be sitting on that chair full obviously not the feeling like you're gonna throw up but you don't want to be dehydrated and like tired and like all dizzy because you haven't eaten because that's not going to go so well. One, because you could probably faint if you're not hydrated or anything. And two, uh, your body will heal better when you actually have the nutrients so your tattoo will uh, heal a lot easier and it won't probably hurt as much. And another thing is you probably shouldn't drink, I believe, 24 hours before or 48 hours before. No alcohol because that can also make uh, the pain a lot easier because apparently it makes your blood thinner or something alcohol and uh, it makes it hurt more and it will not uh, heal as well. So yep, now I'm in the recovery process. I got this special cream to put over it like every once in a while and um, and yeah, uh, I had to take the thing off after a couple hours and I got to trace try to stay out of the sun uh, for a long time because that can make your tattoo fade or again just like the healing process will take longer so uh, I don't want that happening so I guess I'll probably be wearing some uh, long sleeves for now or at least some sleeves up to here just so that I don't feel too hot but uh, again I don't want my tattoo to not 
uh, look good. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I kept this one nice and short and sweet. If you guys are looking to get tattoos in the future and you specifically want fine line tattoos, kind of like what I did where it's a nice thin line, simple design, uh, I definitely suggest uh, going to check out Base to Face. I'll put their Instagram right here. You guys can go check them out and uh, you know, if you want to book, I, I believe you can book somewhere in the link of their bio. The girl that was working there, she's very nice. She knows what she's doing. You just got to come in prepared with the design kind of, or just kind of tell her what she wants and maybe she can help you out a little bit. And uh, yeah, you'll get right to it. It won't be, be that long, depending obviously how big your design was. Like I said, this was like 10, 15 minutes when I, she was doing it, but like a little bit before to get the printing done and the size and everything, but that's how everything works. Her prices are very reasonable too. So go check it out. Thank you guys again. I'm very happy with the tattoo. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button, drop a like on the video and turn on the post notifications. Now it's time for the music video guys. Oh yeah, and one more thing. Uh, over the weekend, I helped my brother shoot a short film that he's making. He's doing another horror film. As you guys know, my brother makes films. Uh, he has his own YouTube channel. I'm sure some of you guys have probably seen some of his past work, like the better ones he's done recently was the lamp walking a photograph uh, all those ones so now this one is called the radio i did the bts part of it and uh let me tell you guys it's looking really good it's one of my favorite ones i think so far too and uh we're only going to keep getting better so i'll make sure to tell you guys when that drops i'll shout it out and stuff like that you guys make sure to go check out his channel if you want but uh, we got some exciting stuff coming i'll make sure to see you guys next time peace out